Okay, good morning, children. So, we are continuing our chapter number seventeen. Okay, verbs and degrees of comparison. All of you open page ninety-eight of your grammar chest. Hmm? Yeah, read the following sentences and insert the adverbs given within brackets in the correct phrase. Uh, sorry, place. She hasn't come back yet. Yet can come here last also, or she hasn't yet come back. Both will be correct. Okay. He is always punctual. The weather nowadays is humid. The boys played noisily in the park. The thief stealthily crept in. Harry Potter seldom used his magic clock. The abandoned dog had nowhere to go. Hmm? The spectators cheered loudly. Loudly will be last only. Or loudly cheered also correct. Hmm? Now degrees of comparison, children. See, like adjectives, many adverbs can also be compared. Now, what is an adverb? It is a word that will tell you more about a verb. Hmm? See, read the given examples. Kanak swam fast. Now see, swim. Swim is an action word. Okay, so this is a verb. How did Kanak swim? Fast. All right. Now. So, Soma swam faster than Kanak. And but Sarita swam the fastest among them all. These are degrees of comparison. In the above sentences, faster and fastest are the comparative and superlative degrees formed by adding er and est to the adverb fast. Adverbs ending in ly or double ly. Are changed to the comparative and superlative degree by adding more and most. See, Monica sang melodiously. Nita sang more melodiously than Monica. Swati sang most melodiously among all and won a prize. Now read the examples given below. Chinna spoke confidently. Tahira spoke less confidently than China. Rita spoke least confidently among them all. Now, in the above sentences, confidently, less confidently, and least confidently are adverbs of comparison. Hmm? Here is a list of such adverbs in the three forms. Children, these you have to learn by heart. Huh? These are very important. Now page number ninety-nine. Sometimes we do not use more or most for adverbs. Sometimes we don't use more and most hmm? to show the comparative and superlative degrees, such as given here. Deadly, worse, worst. Little, less, least. Much, more, most. Good, better, best. So these all everybody has to learn by heart. Now fill in the blanks with the positive, comparative, or superlative degrees of the adverbs given below. Now these children have filled for you, hmm? and you will also fill in your PDF. If you will fill this, then only you will know, you will be able to understand. Ma, thought so much for se, lakh so nahi to samajh nahi pade. So compulsory ko kare na dekhai, jina achha lage to zoom karo. See, Abhishek came early for the concert. Aditya came earlier than Abhishek. Sahil reached the earliest to ensure that he got a seat right in front. The pasta tasted good. Now, good, better, best. The pizza tasted better than pasta. But risotto tasted the best. Of all the Italian dishes, and I relished the food a lot. That means I liked the food a lot. I ate a lot of food. Okay, 
yeah fill in the blanks with suitable adverbs from the box use hints given in the brackets now these also i filled for you so you will fill here also hmm? they have given us what we have to fill what appropriate adverbs which adverbs they have asked adverb of manner hmm? adverb of time or they have given up adverb of degree like that you have to fill so you all will copy ava ki badda ch copy karjo valio please badako ne copy karavcho emni grammar book ma hmm? now page number 100 Yeah, this also I filled for you. You will fill yourselves. Beautiful beauty, merry merriment, sincere sincerely, diligent diligently, loud loudly, careful carefully. These are adjectives. These are adverbs. Okay, and these all I underlined for you. This all you have to fill. So our chapter number seventeen is completed today. Ha huh? and you are having a test you know that no I have already given you I will send you the paper on Tuesday okay bye everybody.